Detroit Smash! All Might, the world's number one hero. In the show known as My Hero Academia, with amazing power, he could knock down his foes and save the day. With his colorful personality and always showing a smile for those around him, he truly is an amazing character. Now why don't we make him in Monster the Heart of World? My name is Scoy School, the anime weeb guy. And I'm Abyssal, the man that can make All Might set a reality in Monster Hunter World. Hello everyone and welcome to another video. And today we have an interesting video where we combine the likes of anime and Monster Hunter into one squishy video of goodness to make builds related to an individual character from the anime. Today we thought of making All Might's build. Just for warning, these sets are not meta. They are created more for fun as we make the set more lean towards how the character works and his personality. We also made the set as beginner friendly as possible for Iceborne. Exactly. So all you need to do is just grind up all these materials for these sets and you should be good. So in the anime, we thought of doing the number one hero in the world, All Might. With All Might's power, it works a bit differently from all the others. His power was brought down from generation to generation and later on gave the power to Izuku Midoriya. All Might is known for his incredible punches and his ability to not give up in any scenario. He could punch his foes with incredible power and knock them out. Before we get any further into the video, we also live stream us on our world on Twitch, and we'll be live once this video is posted, so come by and play with us. We also have a Twitter if you want updates and everything. So we immediately decided that All Might should be a build that hits very hard. So naturally, our first thought was to make a great sword build, but then we thought it would be better suited for him to do blunt damage and be able to KO things, so we settled on Hammer. Also, the Hammer is a giant hand, so yeah. Well, with my expertise and my vast variety of weapon usage, this should be a piece of cake. Or sheath your wap. That was easy! <laughs> wap on. See? Easy! <laughs> well, the skills we decided on this build was to focus on raw damage per hit and KO potential. So with that in mind, here's what we decided on. We used a combination of Diabolus and Black Diabolus to get our set bonus for Slugger Secret. Slugger Secret is a new set bonus that enables you to put two extra points in the Slugger skill, raising the bonus stun power from 40% to 60%. We felt that All Might's strong physical attacks lent themselves to knocking things out as much as possible. Yo, this is kind of like the fight in Season 1 when villains infiltrated UA High School, when the heroes were cornered, and All Might came in to save the day just in the nick of time. But then, the fight between him and Nomu was incredible, with All Might's and a continuous barrage of punches, knocking him out of the training grounds. We went with Critical Boost and Weakness Exploit along with Elementless to get more damage per hit. This honestly was just the easiest way to get more raw damage per hit to match All Might's strength. We also put in Vitality 3 and included a multiplayer build, which drops Elementless in favor of Brace to avoid getting knocked around by your friends. This all makes sense because he does take a big beating in the anime, and always stands up no matter what. Bear in mind that if you don't have all the decorations we've used in this build, namely the expert decorations, this set still has by default a 50% chance to crit on a wounded part and level 2 crit boost along with level 5 slugger. So it'll work, just not quite as consistent with the damage. And that's it! This is what we feel represents All Might and Monster Hunter World. Note that this build is not meta and that it is meant to reflect the character and how he is in the anime. However, these sets can be used effectively sometimes. Thank you all so much for watching. If you enjoyed, don't forget to leave a like and subscribe if you are new for more of these videos. If you have any recommendations for anime characters that you would like to see a Monster Hunter build for, leave in the comments down below. See you all the next time. You can say it once. Bye. Yep. <laughs> <laughs>